what it is, what it does, what it do, YouTube, Infamous Harrison here, and welcome to What's Up Wednesday. And what's up right now is, we're going to talk about Captain Marvel. I know everybody's been on the internet buzzing about Captain Marvel. You know, you had all the SJWs talking about how you should see it, or you're a misogynist, and you're this, and then you have all the comic book nerds over here talking about how don't see it, and how you should support, you know, the this anti-feminist SJW movement or whatever you want to go and call it. Um, well, I li listened to neither side. I pretty much decided to go and see the movie for myself just to see what all the, the fuss was about. And let me tell you, it was a whole lot of nothing. And what I mean by that is, I mean, yeah, the feminist stuff was in there, but it wasn't like so heavy handed, you know, where it was just like, oh God, here we go with this again. But I mean, it was just so ridiculous. I mean, the stuff that they had in there, I mean, it's just unbelievable. But all in all, the movie was great. I mean, it wasn't a bad movie to me, honestly. And I'm not just saying that because I heard somebody else say it. I'm gonna just tell you straight up, I'm gonna keep it real, okay? And, um, and it's pretty much like this. It was a generic action movie. I mean, it was nothing fancy, nothing like sophisticated. It was just a generic action movie. I really didn't, to be honest, it didn't really seem like a Marvel movie. It just seemed like a generic, like, action movie. It just seemed like, I bet, okay. I'm, I'm sorry, I paused for a second, because, like, I'm trying to just think, how could I go and, like, equate this with anything else, or how can it, I can't really explain it, really, like, I don't know if I can compare that to any other, other movie, well, there's about two movies I could go and compare it to, which I'm sure people would probably be upset, but guess what, this is my opinion, and I'm not saying straight facts, this is, you know, my feelings, my thoughts, my concerns, but okay, anywho, like I said, pretty much Captain Marvel, kind of like equivalent to what, let's say Ant-Man or Black Panther, like what I've said before in a previous video that I've done, um, what, like a month ago, like two months ago, so yeah, but you know, the reason why I did that brief pause earlier was because I just had a thought pop in my head and it was pretty much like this. Like, let's say if this movie wasn't backed by Disney or backed by the MCU, would people really want to go see this movie? I mean, I doubt it. I mean, it probably would have made money, but it would have made like 150 mil, but... I don't think this really would have made money, I mean, if it was not backed by Disney or backed by the Marvel Cinematic Universe, you know, Marvel Studios, whatever they call themselves now, I don't know. But I believe it is the, what, the MCU, or I should say Marvel Studios. Let's just get that clear. I don't want anyone to be upset or be mad of me. But, um, yeah. And pretty much like what I said, if it wasn't backed by Disney, or Marvel Studios, this movie would not have had, I don't think, any type of press or any type of uh, box office cash like how it did, you know, opening day. But all in all, the movie wasn't bad. I mean, you know, the story was okay. You know, the acting was okay. You know, Samuel L. Jackson, he was good. You know, Mendelssohn was good. Um, Brie Larson, she was like, uh, it was hit or miss with her. Some parts she did okay, and then other parts it was just kind of like, meh, all right. But um, all in all, I mean, it was just okay. Like I said, it wasn't the greatest, but it wasn't the worst. It was just okay. It was kind of like in between. It was like they could have done a lot with the story, but I mean, seeing the character they working with, she really wasn't like an interesting character to begin with to my Captain Marvel. Cause I mean, I've read a little bit, you know, I've done my homework, I did my research, and it's like, she 
you really didn't do anything great. And like, like me personally, the only thing I can remember about Captain Marvel, aka Ms. Marvel, is that she get her powers took from, you know, took it from her from Rogue, and that was about it. So. You know, that, that's pretty much it. I mean, I really don't have that much to say about the movie. I mean, everybody else, they was like on their soapbox. I'm like, how oh, this is like the worst movie ever. It was a dumpster fire. No, it wasn't that bad. Pretty much this was like one of those like one and done movies where like you go, you know, you decide you want to go to the movies and it's like, huh. Let's see what they've got going there. Oh, Captain Marvel. Let's see what that's about. So you watch it. You know, you had a good time. And that's it. You know, it was nothing that should be like, uh, it wasn't a cult classic. It wasn't anything that was like, it should be like in, in the theater, you know, in, in like cinema history, you know. This in cinema history is the best movie of all times. No. No, it was just okay. And all like the feminist stuff, they, they just need to stop because, you know, this movie didn't, didn't even seem to be really about that. I mean, it was like it tried to be, but to me, it, it really didn't, it didn't do anything for me. That, that didn't make me like, oh, I understand the struggle. Oh my God, you women, you, you just got there so much. And that's not to say that there aren't women out there that do struggle and that are being abused and, you know, victimized because there are, really are women out there, you know, they're, you know, they're being, you know, traded, you know, the sex slave trade and all the other horrible atrocities out there. But I'm talking about, when I say that, I'm talking about the ones that aren't suffering, the ones that aren't being you know, victims are being victimized, you know, they want to just play victim or just want to just play this victim card or narrative, if you will, just so they can get ahead in life. And then that's what I'm saying, like, that needs to stop. That is what truly needs to stop right there. But I'm kind of like going way somewhere else here. So let me just wrap this up by saying, Captain Marvel was okay. If you want to see it, fine. If you don't want to see it, okay, that's fine too. I mean, because the money, bleh, the money, <laughs> the movie still made money, regardless of whether, you know, everybody was on this anti-Captain Marvel, you know, because we hate Brie Larson protest, you know, it made money regardless. So, you know, you really didn't hurt anyone or you really didn't hurt anything, period. So, all in all, like I said, the movie's okay. Uh, am I looking forward to her being an end game? Not really. I mean, she really didn't make me like, oh, I gotta go see Endgame now. Captain Marvel's in the fray. So, I don't know. Uh, let me know you all's thoughts. I mean, were you just like neutral? Were you just like mad? Or were you like picking sides? Were you on the, uh, you know, on the comic book nerds, anti, you know, oh, anti Brie Larson, oh, don't watch this movie. Or were you on the SJW side, or, you know, oh, go see the movie. Or, or you're a misogynist, you're a bigot, you don't like women, you know, I don't know. This is like, this, a video just for a debate, or really not debate, really discussion. But if it is going to be a debate, please let it be a friendly debate and not let it get out of control. With that being said, I'm in for Miss Harrison. And I'm out of here. But before I go, sorry, I keep on, yeah, well, I'm about to go. But before that, and before that, okay, no, let me stop. Um, but like I was going to say, uh, before that, please don't get the like. Please hit that like button, please. <laughs> But anyway, um, hit that like button, share it, um, and the most important thing is subscribe, get addicted to you boy, Infamous Harrison, and uh, remember four things, stay watching, stay gaming, thank Jesus, all shall be well, 
the most important day in state class in Chi-Town. State class in I'm Infamous Harrison, and I 